أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على خاتم النبيين وبعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته oh brothers and sisters I want to speak something about what is happening in Gaza in Palestine and what are the Jews doing and how are the, the, the Muslims suffering you can see this is not the matter of Muslim and non-Muslim this is the, the matter of humankind human beings anywhere if innocent children women and men innocent men are killed every human being has the responsibility to stand up to protect the innocent people from the oppressors the killers from the genociders Almighty God has put this sense of sympathy mercy justice these moral standards moral values Almighty God the Creator has put in every human being I wonder China and Russia they claimed that they were they were going to, to uh, protect uh, people in Gaza and they were going to to prevent Jews from killing but they didn't do anything they are just watching Iran is also watching this is very strange these people the uh, the ways are closed for them Egypt could have opened the way for them Jordan could have uh, opened the way for them but none of them is opening the way for them I will tell you a story I have read this story in the uh, in the Islamic book also and I have heard it also from people that there was a woman who tied up a cat she didn't didn't allow the cat to hunt food for itself and to find water for itself and also she didn't give it water and food and finally the cat died and the neighbors the uh, village people they knew about the behavior of this woman with the cat so a wrath a terrible wrath of Allah Almighty God came on the whole village remember that God is watching Allah is Sami Um Basir, the all hearing, the all seeing. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives time because Allah has created us for a test and always Allah tests one with the other. A rich man who will be having a, a, an expensive car and people will be giving him respect and near him there will be a very poor man in very old clothes having no shoes and people will be looking down at that man but actually Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is testing the rich man with the poor man the poor man is an object of test for the rich man now these innocent people the women the children and the innocent men in Gaza and also in the West Bank in all Palestine they are object of test for for the whole world and especially for the Muslims but unfortunately unfortunately most of the people now have hearts li like stones they are stony hearted they don't care subhanallah Allah's wrath may come in this world and the Muslims believe that we are all going to stand in the court of Allah so we are going to face Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and there will be no escape for the killers and no escape for all those who didn't prevent this, uh, the, this, this killing these genocides I only request all those who have no power those who have no power there are many who are trying their best to prevent this killing but they have no power to reach there 
but there are others who have enough power to stop it but they are not doing anything so those who want to stop it but have no power i request them that please make dua prayer to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ya allah bring you bring your help to the the the, the sufferers the oppressed people in gaza and also in other parts of palestine and ya allah ya allah subhanahu wa ta'ala show the wonders of your power to the killers to those who are doing genocides directly and also to those who are helping these killers may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bring allah's decision allah's decision help to the uh, to the sufferers and a wrath against those who are the killers and genociders please you all make this dua and i make this dua and may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept our dua amen subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifun wa salamun ala al mursalin walhamdulillah rabbil alamin allahumma salli ala muhammad wa ala ali muhammad kama sallaita ala ibrahim wa ala ali ibrahim innaka hamidum majid